Hi guys and welcome back. Today's guest is Disney Joy. Can you say hi? Mowgli's somewhere in here too. Alright, go on. So in today's video, I already have my face done, except my highlighter. Get your tail in my way. Um, we're gonna do my eyes and maybe my lips. I don't know. I might throw a gloss on. We're gonna do a green smoky-ish eye. I don't want a like deep dramatic smoky eye, but knowing me, it'll probably turn into a deep dramatic smoky eye. Um, let's go ahead and get started. Alrighty, so starting out, I am using the Jaclyn Hill and Morphe brushes palette. I'm going to pick up a brush and uh, I don't remember the color of this right now. Give me 30 seconds. And I'm picking up the color in light. And I'm just going to place that all over my lid. From lash line to eyebrow. I'm going to use the color Creamsicle. I really do love this color. I'm just going to place that all over my crease. Disney Joy, knock it off. I had an interview yesterday and I'm super excited about it. Not gonna say where it is. If you know, great. But I'm really excited. Mainly because I've put in like 132 applications in the last two months. And this was the first one I heard back from. Well, no, I heard back from two others, but they wanted to pay me below minimum wage, and I just wasn't having it. Going in with my little ColourPop palette, I'm going in with the color Team Captain. Oh. I'm gonna place that on my crease. Disney, what are you doing? Picking up my fluffy blending brush. Just gonna blend. I can see a little bit of fallout, so I'm going to take my airspun loose face powder. I did get a new one, so it's like packed to the max. It makes a huge mess doing this um, placing like loose face powder under your eye while you're doing your eyeshadow helps from <sighs> sorry um, when you have fallout, like the fallout will land on the loose face powder and then you can just dust it away without worrying about getting color on your makeup that you've already done. Picking up some more of that Team Captain and placing it in the crease. Just picked up a little bit of cream sickle. Cream stick? Cream sickle? Cream sickle. I was right. And I'm just kind of blending out that little bit of a harsh line. I'm literally doing my makeup just to film. Like, I have nothing to do after this. Like, what I'm doing after this is I'm going outside in this heat to cut the grass. I 
I'm back with the Jaclyn Hill and Morphe Brushes palette. I'm going to take that same brush that I was using for Team Captain. I'm going to just pick up a little bit of Enchanted. And I'm going to place it on the outer corner of my eye. Going in with L'Oreal Infallible, 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 Golden Emerald, beautiful, oh my god, I love greens, going in with my finger, like always, oh my god. I want a donut. Mm. I don't know why I can never do my makeup without glitter. I have to have some type of sparkle. Always. Like yesterday for my interview. I wanted to show off my makeup skill. Like that I could look good. And I was like, I'm just going to do a simple smoky eye. No glitter, just a nice sharp wing. Dark. La da 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 Get out of the makeup! Stop licking it! What are you doing? My cat's insane. It likes to test my nerves. Can mom have this? Thank you. With Team Captain. And a small fluffy blending brush. I'm going to just blend... Why does that look dark? I'm not going to do lashes just because most likely I'm just about to wipe all this off because I'm going to cut the grass. So just dust away all that loose face powder you put on. So I've dusted that away. It kind of dimmed down that glitter. So I'm going to just add a little bit more. I don't know why, but I'm getting like a Medusa feel. And with the... I should have had all this out by now. But... Going in with the Maybelline Unstoppable Eyeliner. Just gonna line my top and bottom water lines. Picking up a precision brush. I'm going in with Team Captain. Picking up a lot of the product and smoking out my bottom water line. So I was looking at my calendar today and I go to fest in like 16 days and it still hasn't hit me that like, beach, you going to fest. But I'm getting there and I'm super excited. I kind of want to pick up a little bit more Team Captain. I feel like my crease is a little darker than what I wanted it, but... Side note, when I get bored and I'm like like blending or just doing anything in general, I hum mm -hmm. I don't know why. I always have. It's a weird habit, but 
All right, now to highlight my inner corner and my brow bone. Do I want? I'm debating between going with pearl, like Becca, or going with beam. I think I'm gonna do pearl just because I always use beam. I mean, I guess we'll see. I don't know if I'm feeling the frost. No, I don't think I'm feeling it. No. Beam, I'm coming for you. Sorry, sis. There we are. Yes. Beeper by Color Pop. Do I? Yeah, we would go. I'm going in with. No Schneiky. Just lining and filling in my lips with a nudie color. I don't overdraw my lips. I don't see the point, but I do have a pretty good sized set of full lips, I think. What are you doing? So when I was younger, like braces days, my lip over here got caught in my braces and it tore part of my lip off. So my lips are uneven. So that's really the only part that I overdraw. But. Damn, that's like a perfect match. All right, all right, all right. I went in with, I used the color Rippa. <gasps> Sorry, princess. Used a lip liner from ColourPop called Rippa. It was the Kelly Rippa line. Mama, use um, my palette. Come on, fatty, fatty. Sorry. I saw we. I didn't mean it. The Nicole Guerrero and Anastasia Beverly Hills palette going in with Kitty Cat Forever Young Glow Getter. I went for three. Mine as well. I'm picking up Forever Lit. Normally, I would probably put on lashes with this look, but I don't want to. I didn't even put mascara on. But that is the end of today's video. I hope you all enjoyed. Um, I'm sorry I've been a little bit MIA. But I hope y'all come back soon. Bye!